Hi guys, in this video you will learn how you can make a fully automatic salary slip easily in Excel. So first of all go to view tab and select page layout. Select column A and F and set the column width 0.45. This time you will select the column B, C, D, E and set the column width 1.5. Now leave the first row and merge second row from column B to column E. Here you can write your company's name. Same as it is merge the next row and write your company's address. Now let's adjust the font size of company name. Again leave one row and merge the next one and write salary slip. Adjust font size. Make it bold and add thick bottom border. Enter here employee's ID, employee's name, designation and month and year. Select all these, add border and adjust the font size. Write here earnings and deductions. Merge these and adjust the font. Under earnings write basic, DA, HRA, TA and total addition. Now under deductions write provident fund, ESI, loan, tax and total deductions. Skip one row and write net salary and salary in words. Select all, add border and align in center. Merge these cells. Write here salary paid by cash or check. Align in center. Go to developer tab and insert check box and adjust it. You can easily tick the box accordingly. Merge these cells, write here employee signature and director. You can use underscore for underline. Now select this area, add thick border and fill white color. Select earnings and deductions cell and fill this color. Add some function to calculate total earnings and deductions. For the net salary, add equal, select the total addition and minus total deductions. To bring salary in words, we'll use spell number function. You won't get this function by default, you can check my video how to get this function. I'll put the link in description. So now it's looking good as it's almost done. You can fill manually details for each employee. But as mentioned in video's title, we'll make this salary slip fully automatic. As you can see, I have this another sheet where I have salary details for employees. I'll just link with salary slip so we do not need to add details manually. First, we'll make drop down list of employees ID. Go to data tab. Click here and select list. Select the employee ID list and hit the enter. As you can see, now we have a list where we can pick any employee ID. Now we need to add xlookup function to get results associated with the employee ID. I have made a detailed video on how to use xlookup function. You can check it out, I'll put the link in description. So we'll add xlookup, then lookup value which is employee ID, then lookup array and return array. As you can see we got the employee name. So same as it is we'll add same formula to other cells as well.
Once done, select these cells and format cells and choose your currency. Now let's see if we change the employee ID, does it change the results? So as you can see it's showing the results as required. So this is how you can create a cell B slip easily. If you have any questions do let me know in comment section I'll be happy to assist you any further. Thanks for watching this video see you in next video bye bye.